Hey guys, today we're looking at some tips and techniques that I use to get to those balls that are chipped over you when you're caught out of place. Uh, so the first thing we want to look at when we're tipping these balls is how we're stepping back. We never want to turn our back on the soccer ball. We always want to keep our head up and looking towards the ball. So when we do the shuffle backwards, we actually want to do a side shuffle while keeping our eyes on the ball. Make sure when you start shuffling backwards that you're dipping your back shoulder down towards the ground and you're raising your opposite top hand and leg when you jump up. By doing this, you're giving yourself that coverage of the area. A lot of these balls are going to dip down. You want to make sure that your hand is as high as possible covering any angle. By doing this, you're making sure that if the ball does dip, you still get a tip on the ball and you can tip it over the crossbar. The most important thing is to shuffle with your eyes always on the ball. You need to make sure that you're shuffling as fast as possible, but that you're shuffling back towards the goal and that your legs aren't covering or crossing each other. If they cross each other and something happens, diving in the air is going to be a lot harder and your legs are going to get tangled up when you decide to dive. And always make sure to get to the soccer ball with your top hand. The top hand is always going to be a lot stronger. You're going to be able to put more power into your parry. And it covers more area. You need to make sure that you're making these saves with your top hand every single time. So you've been caught out of position and you need to get in the air and to a chip shot as soon as possible. Remember these few things. Drop your back shoulder and start to shuffle backwards towards the goal while keeping your eyes on the soccer ball. And always make sure when you jump up, you're raising your leg and your opposite hand or your top hand. Make sure that you're punching the ball or parrying the ball out with your top hand and you will make sure to make every single chip save a good safe save. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching my tips and tricks on how to tip a soccer ball over the goal. Uh, if you liked the video, please click like. If you haven't subscribed already, please subscribe. Thank you guys again, and I'll see you guys again next week.